Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a mock plan with me and this is just a look back at the last one that I did. I wanted to do a spread using all of my holiday stickers and I successfully did it so I'm pretty proud of it. But this is how it turned out. I used a planning roses kit and I had a lot of fun. Um, but today we are going to be doing a mock spread and because I got this planner just for mock spreads there's not a whole lot filled out in here so I'm just going to keep going with it for mock spreads until I run out of room and um, hopefully it gets me to when they do the 50% off Erin Condren sale again when the new planners are going to come out because that's when I got this one and I think it's a perfect time to get like a mock planner or if you just need like a space to test out kits or layouts or anything like that. So this is the kit that I'm going to be using today. It's from JB Planning. It's her Stay Cozy kit. I'm not too sure if she still has it anymore, but it is a pretty wintry kit, so she might. I would head on over there and check it out. I'm hoping to do a pretty functional spread with this. Um, I'm not too sure how that's going to work. I've been seeing a lot of spreads um, on Instagram and in Facebook groups and stuff like that that I think are very, very functional and not as decorative. I don't, I'm not too sure how to explain it, but I kind of wanted to use this kit and just experiment with some things that I've been seeing, some things that I thought would be cool, and anything like that. So I have this kit, and I also have a huge stack of washi over here. Um, these are from like a ton of different places. These two are from Scott, or yeah, Scotch brand. And then this one's Simply Gilded, and this one I got off of Etsy somewhere. I totally forget from where. Same with this one. This one was from Target and this one's from Hobby Lobby. So I'll definitely link Simply Gilded down below as well as JB Planning. And then another warning. I'm going to fast forward through this video just so it doesn't take a long time because like I said, I am experimenting and trying to do something different. But I do have my two sticker binders here that house all of my um, sticker collection. So I may reach for those, may not. We'll see what happens. But like I said, it's just going to be an experimental spread, which is what I normally do with my mock spreads. So I'm going to jump right into this, listen to the fun music, and then I will be back at the end to show you guys the finished result.
right guys, here's the completed spread. I don't really know what happened, but I just kind of started going with what I thought looked good. And I thought, well, here's what I was thinking. I thought that by leaving this section open down here, I could focus on stuff that was more for like myself or like, you know, nighttime events or anything like that. Keep this for like a to-do section and then this for like the stuff that happens maybe all the time or on a schedule or whatever. Um, so that's why I put like filming and then these are the days that I usually go and have lunch out. Um, I have work in, I have school in with little washi strips. Um, I tried to like section this off a little bit more because she had split washies so that this was like nighttime, this was like daily routine stuff and this was like to do. Um, so so that's where like the functional thing that I was talking about came into play. Um, but what I do have to say about this spread, oh, only sticker that I pulled in was this Ninja Unicorn Creative Family Time sticker because I was trying to think of stuff that I do to kind of inspire me. But I do have to say that I was inspired by this mock spread to do a totally different mock spread in the future. Probably not the next one that I do um, because I already have a kit that I want to use. Um, but probably the one after that, I really want to do a whole spread using just washi tape because I had a lot of fun doing like the rips here and kind of using it as the backing and stuff like that. As you can see, I definitely didn't use all of the kit. Um, I used a good amount of it because I used like the date cover-ups, the heart checklist, icons, all that good stuff, but I definitely stuck to keeping it functional and also pulling in that washi. So I really like how this looks. I'm not going to fill it out. I usually don't fill out my mock spreads um, just because I do film these after I film my other videos. So I get kind of tired of filling out planner stickers. So I hope you guys understand. But I really do like this. If this inspires you to try out a new type of style in your planner or if you do a mock spread or something like this, definitely tag me in it on Instagram. I would love to see it. I really do like seeing different types of spreads or people going out of their comfort zone um, and stuff on Instagram and all that jazz. So yeah, let me know down below if this is something you've tried, if this is something you do already, if this is something you want to try. I would love to hear from you guys, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Mm -hmm.